Hi, we are Heidi, Tim, and Jesse, and we're working on a Keurig for food using robotics. Music and food have parallels. Scores are similar to recipes, so if good music can be heard by pushing a button, why can't food be created in the same way? We believe we can build an automated cooking machine. Using a milk crate, some paint servers, and a few servers, we could replicate how a human cooks. Ben decided to build an app that can teach the machine how to change arm motions and reach different parts of the pot so that you can create your own recipe. It wasn't perfect. We spilled some food and decided to make our pot's walls higher. We saw from this simple model that by using robotics, people understand the benefits of humanoid cooking in a single machine. The food that was made was quite good. The pasta was all dente. We partnered with Georgia Tech and made a 3D printed arm with higher torque and a solid chassis that couldn't be damaged easily. Here's a view from the top as it manipulates ingredients around, like how you normally cook. We added an automated loading mechanism that dispenses each ingredient into the pot. Here's our first manual run. To begin operation, load each ingredient into the machine and place it in the vertical carousel. Connect your smart device, pick the associated recipe, verify all ingredients are in there, and push one button to start cooking. Each ingredient is lowered down the vertical carousel in a stacking order until it's ready to be dispensed into the pot according to instructions from the recipe. As this is happening, the arm is continuously moving to prevent food from sticking together. Ingredients are carted from the back of the machine and poured inside. The arm moves out of the way during this action. Nice. The meal has been cooked, an alert is generated telling you it's finished. Broccoli and bow ties. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why I turned the oil because it was really freaking hot.